wonderful day. We'll see you tomorrow. Jay Manuel is back for some beauty products and Guy is taking over for all things home at Home Show. Adios. Thank you. <laughs>
This one also extends, but if you're looking for one to go along with it, uh, maybe you're not doing a job that needs the extension as much, you've got the smaller pole available. And again, this one is only $14.95, and that one also attaches to the water. What else you got for all me, All this, we're going to move out to the RV here in a second. Okay. But all this without getting up on this big dangerous ladder anymore. And remember this, guy. If you're cleaning these hard-to-reach areas with water, with hoses, with cleaning liquid, whatever, yeah. you're not only pulling out the ladder, but as soon as you clean one thing... Your feet are wet, now your ladder's wet. It makes it even more dangerous. Yeah. Without even really extending this pole, I'm already taller than the ladder by about six feet, safely yeah. from the ground, grabbing these sponge grips so I've got control of this pole. And then here's the most important thing. Mm -hmm. Whatever attachment you have on this, if you can get in nice and close on this, it not only attaches to your hose, but here's the soap attachment. You can not only put your car cleaner and your floor cleaners, but your concrete cleaner, your lime and remover, all the things that you want to do, hard water spots I just had on the side of my house, got a nasty gram from the uh, HOA. I was able to get over the hedge line and clean all that hard water from my sprinklers off without getting on a step ladder. All right, Let's listen, we're gonna guy. show you so many different ways that you can utilize this. I only have about a thousand of the compact brush available if you want that for $14.95. My favorite thing about this too, Tim, is the fact that we can add our detergent, our liquid, our car wash, soap, whatever it is that we want to add, because think about it, when you get, I've got a whole side of my house that's got bug junk and gook on there, maybe you got those little mud daubers that are getting stuck, uh, you know, in and around the, the cracks and crevices of your house. What's so nice about having this system is you can get rid of that without any pesticides, any chemicals, just use your ordinary tap water or you can use ordinary soap. All right, I'm going to update you. Hey, Aaron, how many of these small brush do we actually have left of the compact brush? 1,000 of these to go around. And remember, it still has the little water attachment, but this is great for car wash and stuff like that. You can get this for $14.95. And which are the most limited in? Orange and lime are the most limited in this. Remember, first time we're doing it in the, in the big bag, it's like a ski bag. It's fantastic. So everything fits in there. So if you need to travel with it, if you want to bring it out, uh, you know, to the boat yard or to, if you're doing your RV, you can deal with that as well. Speaking of RVs, this, you know, Tim, this is something you'd never want to get on a ladder to do, right? No, cars, trucks, especially RVs and SUVs, you don't want to get on the ladder, especially not the wet ladder. Now you have a specially built long bristle brush that's super soft so it won't damage paint, but special long so it can get in grills and around corners. And check this out. Again, I said, if you only bought this to get up and clean your hard to, hard to clean trucks and cars and SUVs, they charge about 250 to 350 to clean an SUV and now I've got suds coming out. I'm able to switch back and forth and rinse. I can do the tops and the bottoms. This is such a safe and easy way to save big money. Do things yourself. This is an empowering tool. Men, women, you will get control of this. Be able to clean all the way around on your big trucks, even if you have just an SUV or a big uh, van or a camper, you know what they charge you to clean these things. Not even a detail, just a wash, they upcharge you. Now you're able to do that quickly and easily. Now if I switch this back with just the flip of a button to just now water, rinsing, right? once the suds come flush through, now I can rinse and you see the water pouring out of there. All right, now you see the suds coming off there. Now oh, if I switch yeah. to my squeegee attachment, I can clean these big huge windows safely and easy. Okay, look at the suds just washing that, off now of there. Now that, that is probably, a, it's got to be at least 11 feet, 12 feet up over our head. Not even extended. There's, there is no way you would ever be able to reach that and as Tim said, you'd have to rely on somebody else, professional car wash people to deal with that. Look at how squeegee Squeaky clean it is, and you did it all yourself. You get all the tools that you need. This is $40 off our regular price. It's going to be $89.95 at the end of the day. You're going to use this all summer long. Think about it. Not only to wash your car. Maybe you do have a boat. I mean, I know uh, even my son Dan just got a jet ski trying to get that done. Maybe use the shorter brush for that. By the way, I have 900 of the shorter brushes left. So if you want that, you need to be online quick. We only have six minutes or so. Think about all the hard to reach areas, the tires, wheel wells, way up above. Maybe you own a van or an SUV and you need to get over the top. How else would you do that without getting on a ladder? Look at what Tim's okay. doing. Not even a ladder. Tim's you washing the floors. All, your decks are filthy from the fall and the winter. Now, if you want to get out here, put in your favorite cleaner. Or if your driveway and your pavers are dirty, now without switching back and forth from hose to cleaner to scrub brush, you've got to listen to that hard bristle. That. Now you're, you're getting this squeaky, squeaky clean. Uh, you know what makes it for me, Tim, is having the, you got the soap and the water in one step. One step. You don't have to do that as two separate processes. Not and back then and you forth. can turn it off. Now I'm going to turn this back to just rinse. And you see the water coming out of that? 
That's a great hard mist that's gonna get that out of there. That spray is gonna give everything a rinse down. And you know, Tim, you know what's funny? We got these gutters behind us. <laughs> and you know, we're, these are, this is actually our little faux house. Yes. But normally, gutters are not this tall. No. I want you to realize <laughs> well, that, that guy, is, guy is giant. Right. I normally I am. I come from the land of giants. <laughs> but normally, look at how high up he can go. You can actually get and get water into the gutters, help clean those out as so well. Here I am. It's not even fully extended. Yeah, check but it look, out. This is without getting up on this dangerous ladder anymore and cleaning off your siding or without spending that couple hundred dollars to get somebody out. But I'm getting all the way up on top of the siding. You, by the way, People have asked me, Leslie was talking hey, about this last show. Are you getting in the nooks and crannies? I am a nook and cranny getter. That's all I needed to know. It's like an English muffin up here. <laughs> now, Thank you for that. Leslie asked, hey, why not just the pressure washer? Right. You don't want to take your pressure washer to the side of your house and take the paint and the siding off. Yeah. And on top of that, you'd still have to get up on the ladder. You know what else you'd have to do, Mr. Wilkins? What's you'd that, You'd have guy? to find an outlet, my friend, right? Or you'd oh, have to good start point. if you got one of those gas pressure washers, which are just, nah, I don't want to deal with that. This is quiet. It's peaceful. Oh. Oh. You're cleaning your house, and you're actually getting that, you're getting a scrub in there, yeah. which does the work well, of the pressure washer. You, you bring you know, up I, a great point. We get a lot of mud daubers here in Florida. You know those little, those the, little insects? Little nests. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what else we have in Florida? We have uh, pool cages. We are, our pools are caged in with screens yeah. because we have bugs here in Florida that'll carry your babies away. So you have to screen your pools. And the, our pool cage was just completely covered in dirt and pollen. And to keep the allergies down, I was able to clean the pool cage without getting on a ladder. And a lot of the pool cage is over the pool, so you can't even get on a ladder. So now with that 16-foot extender, I'm able to get in there. With the L extension, I'm actually able to use the seven pattern nozzle and blast down inside the gutters and clean those out. But these long bristles are perfect for cleaning all around this, getting all those hard to reach places safely and easily. If you have shutters on the first and second floor, getting those clean, getting in those nooks and crannies is always a task. I'm able to put on some soap and get some suds going. Watch this suds up here in just a second. There we go right there. Now I'm able to clean all around the sills and jams all up in here. I'll be able to clean. Look at that window. Nice and dirty. I'm able to get that as well and I'll be able to change over the window attachment and get all the different sections of that window. All right, what do don't you got forget, there, buddy? I got the little shorter attachment that if you wanna get that, it also attaches to your hose right there. But if you need to do things like car wash stuff, stuff where you wanna do furniture, oh, where yeah. you don't need the extra long pole, this is ideal for that. And I believe Aaron just told me there's about 800. Wow, these are going really fast. And by the way, this does telescope a little bit as well too. So it's got a little bit of room. You can make it real short like that. So if you're just, you know, you're good to go there. Outdoor furniture. See, now Out I might use I might use the shorter pole for that. I would. Unless I wanted to keep far away from it, like you are. And go now, ahead, do guy, it. whether you're washing, whatever you're doing, <laughs> if you want to check out the seven pattern nozzle, I'm going to blast off my furniture and I'm going to clean it. But this seven pattern nozzle, as we get up on here, you'll see all the different ways that you're able to get a pattern. Think about just what you would spend on one of these nozzles. Let's give that a turn. All the different ways you can water, rinse, get a nice pattern going for the lawn, get up. Look at how beautiful that is. Now, if I'm gonna go blast off my furniture before the new year to get this up and running, this is the kind of spray I want going on this guy. Look how beautiful that is. And this is also the attachment that I'm gonna use with my angle attachment, the angle pole, to blow out the gutters so I don't have to hire somebody to come do my gutters. Again, quickly and easily. Think of what you'd pay for just one of these nozzles. This is a seven to 10 to $15 upgrade that you would get out in the big box stores. Now, if I've got my plants and stuff that I really wanna soak or I wanna give a nice mist to, to start the new year, if you've got a window box up on the second story, this is a great way to get up there and water all that as well. Let's come back over to our RV team. Let's come check out what we've got going over here because I, I, I can't stress enough. If you have a boat, a truck, a boat you have to clean every time you take out. If you have a, a boat or a truck, you're able to get up here with soap without getting on a ladder. Let's turn on our soap. You're able to clean those trucks, SUVs, vans, campers. There we go right there. Look at how easy that is to clean 
your big accessories, all your fun toys. If you have, uh, like Guy was just saying, a jet ski, you're able to clean your jet skis. Those have to be cleaned and maintained. And you can do it without going to one of those coin-op places and chasing the, the chasing the quarters and running around like a crazy person and banging up your boat. How fun and easy is all of this? And I'm able to just wipe that off. I am gonna now switch this over to the squeegee attachment like I'd use for my second story windows. All the attachments, the bag, the telescoping pole that gives you the ability to clean up to 16 feet away, this is the way to do all that without getting on that ladder, without getting on a wet ladder, or without paying big money to have someone come out to your house, clean your windows, clean your roofs, clean your gutters, clean your second stories. This is easy, easy. Guy, what do you have going on inside? Uh -huh. Oh, you did a good job. Thank you, Tim. We appreciate you uh, finishing up for us outside. And remember, you can still get that best value of the day at a fraction of the price, free shipping and flex pay. Hey, I want to remind you, we got something really cool coming up. For any of you just looking for a little extra added decorative touch, we got something really neat. It's called the Everglasting Glow Multifunction 10-inch LED light string. Uh, you can use this for anything, just decorating anywhere you want. You see, we've got it in a little bit of a little atrium box there. Uh, we've also got it surrounding a mirror over on the other side. Super fine little lights. They're flexible. It's 10 inches long. It has 60 LEDs built in. You can use it indoors or out. It's battery operated, so you don't have to plug it in. Uh, and it has four different functions, and it even has a six hour timer. So that's coming up in just a little bit. Right now, we want to talk to you about a little uh, at home 101. All right, and this is important this morning. I think you heard me earlier when I said I wanted to try to help you create your own backyard oasis. Well, the first thing that you need to do is find a cozy spot in your backyard, then add some comfy seating and finish it with whatever helps you to chill. So maybe it's a fire pit or it could be some beautiful flowers. I know I enjoy my flowers. I enjoy my herb garden as well. If you want to find these pins or more inspiration by, uh, to create your own backyard oasis, just check out the Outdoor Living Board on Pinterest. All right. And welcome back, everybody. We have now brought a little bit of the outside inside so we can show you something really cool. What I will tell you is it's gonna sell out very quickly. I have 244 of these uh, wall sconces left. It comes from Maxa. This is our motion sensing indoor outdoor LED wall sconce. We've got it today at $49.95 and it's on FlexPay. What this is for you and me is instant light anywhere. Uh, if you wanna put it outside of a door, a backyard, but it's a motion sensor so it's gonna turn on when it detects motion so it is a wonderful wonderful security light. It installs in a matter of seconds or minutes. You can either stick it on or you can actually screw it on any given wall. It has the built-in motion detection, automatically activates at dusk. So when the lights come down, it is activated and when it feels or sees motion, it will turn on instantly. What does that mean? When you come to the door, it'll light up. When you're going around the backyard, it'll light up. When you're walking down those stairs, it will light up. It's a great safety device. You install it in second. There's no wires. It's built-in battery. And the LED means that light is gonna last thousands and thousands of hours. Energy efficient LD, LEDs means it's gonna last not just months, but years. Mr. Matt Davis is here. Hey, Guy. Thank you, you for bringing a little light. A little light. Into the at-home show, my friend. That's right, exactly. This is I, a great idea. Well, how beautiful are they to begin <laughs> with? I love the copper look. These are from Maxa. They're the folks that bring you real innovation when it comes to LED lighting. And outdoors, you know, the old motion detector lights, the old, the old lights that you could get and you'd have to have an electrician yeah. you know, come to your house. I have those, you know what, they don't work anymore. Yeah. And I called the electrician and he said, 150 bucks to come fix the wiring. Yeah, I said, thank you very I much. I don't think I need the light that bad. Yeah, exactly, yeah. you have to wire these and they yep. look, they'd look good in a prison yard, I think. That's about the only place yeah, these would right. look any good. But take a, look, take a look at the Maxa. These look beautiful during the day and during the night when they turn on automatically with motion. These are gonna welcome you home when you drive up the driveway, when you walk up, to, walk up to your front door or anyone walks up to the front door. These are automatically gonna turn on. They're so simple to put in. They take four C cell batteries. Right. You pop those in and it's gonna last for over one year on so one set of batteries. One set of batteries 
batteries for the year. For the year, you don't have to worry about it. But when it comes time to change them, very, very simple. It takes two screws to put it up. You can put it on railings, you can put it on posts, you can put it on places that you wouldn't normally be able to put lights. And look how beautiful they look. Again, this is a gorgeous look, a way to make your home, take it to the next level. Look at how nice and this is. And you're getting yeah. the motion activated. And, I love and, that. And you know what's missing? And I gotta tell you, I have a, I have a, an old flicker lamp that's in my house, but it's got a wire, it's got a cord. Right. And I, I spent a lot of money to have that cord buried behind the wall because I didn't yep. want to see it. There's no cords or wires here. So you have a clean look that looks like it was professionally installed. Absolutely. And it'll come on anytime you get in front of it. So they're motion activated. They automatically become sensitive as soon as the light goes out. So whether you want to have it on a porch or a patio or whether you want to have it, you know, outside because they are indoor outdoor, you're going to get that same great look. Yep. I have 230. Five. Oh, this is it. And only yeah. only I've left is the copper, so this is going to sell out. Yeah, this is this is a quick one. But again, this is motion activated. There's a little sensor on the front. Anything within 30 feet or so, when it goes by, it's automatically going to come on. So you're going to know when someone's coming up to your front door or your back door, anywhere around the house that you want to put these. Maybe you want to get a couple and you want to flank your front doors or you want to flank the garage. And again, it looks beautiful. During the day, it looks fantastic, too. It doesn't look like one of those big, ugly lights. You don't have to have any electrician come out. You can put these up. Anybody can put them up uh, just with a couple screws. Got very, beautiful. very simple. I love the, the look of them. And I those mean, are metal got, and glass. They're all the metal way. and glass. Yep. They're antiqued on the outside with this copper finish. And they really are substantial. There's the little sensor right there, which just yep. melts into it. Don't you love the kind of light that comes off of it, too? You can see how pretty it is. You're going to put this up on a wall. In a matter of minutes, it takes to put it up, and then you're gonna enjoy that year after year. The batteries that you put in will last one full year, at yep. least. On one set right. of batteries, absolutely. Yep. Look at that, two screws. You put the mounting plate on there, and then there's just two screws that go on it and hold it to the mounting plate, that's it. You can put it on concrete, you can put it on any kind of siding, you can put it on any kind of posts. Maybe you have a dock in the backyard, or maybe you have a, a, um, a separate building where you put uh, like a shed in the back, yeah, yeah, and yeah. you wanna put motion lights out there. They, I have they a give shed. You that Security. And there's no light out there. That's See? a really good idea. Yeah. See, you put them out by a shed. Yeah. So if you, maybe you have, uh, like my friend Julie Truster, she has uh, a separate garage from her house and it didn't, they didn't wire it for electricity, but she has, um, it's like a separate area out there where she puts all of the lawnmower and all that. But if there's people creeping around out there, you want to have that light come on. So it gives you that security of knowing who's out there, who's creeping around. It gives you that sense of security, but it does it in a beautiful way. That's why I love that. That's why these are so popular. You know, and everybody, has that place in their property where it's a little dark mm -hmm. and you don't Absolutely. like to go there I you know back by my um, where my air conditioning compressor is right. and that's back where like the controls are also for my um, my um, lighting my landscape lighting right. and there's no light out. that's that's where the motion light was that broke right. but it's way up high in the house and I've just let it yeah. go I could put one of these up right there and now I have illumination wherever I go and you put it up in Guys, minutes you could put this down and you could put this down in a basement where there's a fuse box you could put it in where you know the power goes out and you still have light yes. Right? I mean, Absolutely. think about I that. love that look there, too, with the LED lights, too. The LEDs yeah. that are coming up are really beautiful. But again, you can see the variety of solutions that you can get with beautiful LED lighting. And again, the folks at Maxa are the experts on LED lighting. Motion activated, metal and glass construction, by the way. That's why they've been such a big hit here at HSN. And we've only got a few left, and they're going to be gone. That, here that's it. I got, yeah. yeah, I got maybe 180, 170 of these to go around for yeah, everybody if you it. want it. $49.95. Reduced shipping and handling on this, and it's on FlexPay, $24.98. I know really quick, my friend, we didn't have a lot in the house. So nope, this is it. Nice a, job, a as one, always, yeah. Mr. Matt Davis, Thank bringing you, us a little light. Hey, I wanted to remind you, also uh, still available, if you would like, don't forget about shopping our set. We got lots of cool stuff that's on this set that you can grab. One of the things I know you're saying is standing out right now, obviously, is that beautiful pillow. Uh, this is our uh, Leora Man 20 inch square daisy orange pillow. It's $59.95, all hand done. It is absolutely gorgeous. I'll walk over and I'll just show you. It's a beautiful pillow. I'll show you the front and the back, gorgeous size. Uh, this is all uh, embroidered in here, stitched on. Really, really gorgeous. I'll pull it out so you can see it a little bit more. Uh, really a nice accent piece. 
use, whether you're using it for your outdoor garden, anywhere in your home, you'll love it. It's free shipping and handling today, 481-494. Please feel free to shop the selection that we've got there at hsn.com. And I'm gonna update you. How many left of the shorter brush, Aaron, with the today's special? So now we have about 650 of that short brush that accompanies our today's special. So if you want to scrub uh, in and around the house, it's perfect for that. All right, we're going to continue on. Alexandra Baker is here. Hi. Hello, my How dear. How are you? Good, Good morning. Good to see you. I have to tell you, when I saw this, I was so excited because yep. there are so many places in my home where I want to add a little bit of light, yes. a little accent lighting, but I don't want to use a plug. I just, you know, it could be something that's up on a shelf. It could be something there that I want to wrap around something. Exactly. Uh, something I want to put inside. This lighting is called Everlasting Glow. It's a multifunction 10 inch LED light string. You will use this anywhere and everywhere. Think about yep. it. You can wrap this around a banister. You could wrap this around a vase. You could put it around flowers, a bottle, a wine glass, anything you want with these wonderful LEDs. It works on batteries, multifunction, it even has a timer. And while you're able to catch all these colors, look at these beautiful colors. We've got the beautiful sapphire blue, that vibrant red, the warm white light that beautiful green, that electric green, and then of course, amber. Is that, which is the most popular, did you say, Aaron? The warm white is the gonna be the first one to go. The warm white will be the first to go. And you know, always, these are a huge customer pick. We always have these, these are our micro LED lights. These are wildly popular. You just love that they're so malleable. You can wrap them around just about anything. They're quite durable. You can see how rough I'm being with them. You don't have to be ginger with these. Check this out. If you're working with like a little bit of a camera frame, uh, a camera frame, because I'm looking at the camera. Right. If you're working with a photo frame and you need it to be exact, you can take a pair of scissors and look at this. Just snip. Can you see this? Mm -hmm. Snip the end. Doesn't affect the and rest. And it does of it. not affect the rest of the lights. Yeah. And look, if we could just dim the lights just a tad, you can even. I'm going to put them into a vase. You can place them in hurricanes, place them into lanterns, place them into to uh, topiaries, and then I can even add oh, water. Oh, you're not gonna fill that with water. Uh, so if you're a bride or a party planner, wow. or you've got a baby shower coming up, a bridal shower, you're doing oh your tables gosh. for your wedding, That's awesome. the lights can be submerged in water. Can you imagine this with a beautiful floral arrangement? Oh. There's so much that you can do. Put them in your garden, put them on the deck. You you can uh, wrap them around the topiaries. The battery pack is water resistant. We have them here in this little shed in this beautiful little box. I Such a that. lovely decorative item. You can, they're battery resistant, a uh, water resistant, but then the lights themselves are waterproof. What I love about them is you could even put them around the greenery. Look, I'm wrapping them just around a simple rose. See how it's illuminating oh, the flower? It's so beautiful. But you know what? They're cool to the touch guy, so I don't have to worry about right, what LED. happens to the flowers. They're they cool they don't to the give touch. Off, they don't give off any heat. That right. heat is reflected through LED. Um, it comes in a little battery pack. You can set it uh, to go off and on on a timer, which I love as well. So if you want to use it decorating like a wreath like you see there, or if you want to have it in an area of your home where, you know, you don't want them on during the daytime, you can program it to deal with that as well. It's multifunctional as well. So it'll, it'll, does it do different blinking patterns and oh, things like that? Oh, let me tell you. Because so, I want to, let's go through our patterns. So this is really exciting. It's not four patterns. I heard you mention, we can bring the lights back up. Oh, you know what? Maybe leave it like this so you can see how nice and bright they are. Look at this. This is a beautiful apothecary jar that I have. Look at how it has completely changed the look of the jar. But can you see what's happening with the light? Is it going it's up morphing and, down? and changing different patterns. Oh, it's nine different patterns. Uh, just the wow. click of a button. I can have it on this wave. I can choose a slow fade that's like in and out. That. Yeah. I can just have it on steady on. Isn't that look brilliant? At, look at what it's done. Because turn it off for a second. Just, just if you can. Let turn me work my way watch. down to the different. So there it is. And now <clears throat> it's off. So here you have a nice vase. Right? Beautiful vase. Very beautiful. Vase. Now we're gonna bring but it to life. when you turn it on, now you really bring this oh to life. My gosh. Now you probably have, if you look here, these lovely mason jars. You know, if you were lucky enough to purchase your mason jars from HSN, our mason jars came with some string lights. <laughs> If you have ordinary mason jars at home that don't have the effect of the light, you can just pop this That's right 
in cool there. Too. And notice, these are 10 feet long. So I'm actually able to decorate a couple of items if I have them near each other with the same string light. And these are so wonderful. You can just change the pattern. But here's the best part. They are working on a timer. So many of the options, I'm going to show you right here on the box. See the different options that are available yeah, to they, you? Yeah, they list them right there, which Some is nice. Some of them, yes, are listed with timer. The timer, six hours on, 18 hours off, and this way you set it and forget it. And I want to show you one of the places this, where in my just, home I have them now. This blows me away. Look I at how nice that is. Isn't that so simple yep. to really take it up? What about if you have those lanterns sure. uh, on your patio deck? You can bring those Ooh. to life. You see that on the wreath? Right now we have the spring wreaths that have oh, like hydrangeas that. That. and flowers. Twinkling. You can do that. Isn't that exciting? So pretty. And then look at what I've done. This is what I did. I, I got the idea over the holidays, but uh, I've left it out all year. I have a beautiful bar in my kitchen, and the bar has lots of different, you know, okay. liquor and things. This is a tray that I loaded with the bar and some, and some barware. When I just dropped in so beautiful. the lights, it really brought the bar to life. There you go. Isn't that pretty? So imagine having a party. Now, this doesn't have to be just for a party. Obviously, it's going to take your party up a notch. And obviously, if you're doing something fancy, uh, you can, you know, if you have a buffet or a dessert table, you're able to decorate it that way with these string lights. But just dropping them on your garden or dropping them here as I have on a tray with some barware. And it's just so much fun when... I walk into the kitchen in the evening and they oh come gosh. on automatically. These are going to be great. And, you know, we're not even near the holidays yet. Wait till you get to the holidays when you want to decorate stuff. You know, you want to do wreaths outside. You yes. want to do decorations, things like that. So grab them now while it's only $16.95. Yep. Customer event priced uh, with reduced shipping on there as well. Comes yep. in amber, blue, green, red. The most popular, of course, is the warm white. $16.95 is the event price. Kitchen grab it. cabinets great, everywhere. Great everywhere. job. Thanks, Alexander. You're so welcome. All right. Hey, listen, I want to remind everybody, we've got something coming up which is going to surely impress you and blow you away. Uh, it's uh, called the Amitha Verma Transform 7-Piece Paint Kit. So what this is going to allow you to do is take any piece of furniture, something you might even be thinking about throwing away. Maybe you saw a nice piece of furniture in a tag sale or flea market, and you're like, hmm, I think I could turn that into a magical piece. Well, with Amitha's kit, you can. It shows you everything you need in simple steps, how to take ordinary furniture and transform it into something extraordinary. Transform the old, the furniture, the cabinets, the chairs, any beautiful piece. You can update your decor in 60 minutes or less. What I love is that she makes it easy to do. Hey, listen, there's a lot of professional faux painters out there that'll charge you twelve hundred dollars to decorate a chair but who's got that kind of money and who's got that kind of time you can do it yourself for less than a hundred dollars everything you need including the paint we're going to take a quick break we'll be right back at home cooking is my life mm. Cooking at home for my family is a special time. So I want everybody out there to have a great time in the kitchen while they're cooking. And the most important thing is to have the right appliances and the right pots and pans. I give it to all my chefs in the restaurant and they give me suggestions and they try them out. And so can you at home. and welcome back in everybody we're really really excited if any of you has tried Amitha Verma's kit we'd love to take your testimonials we'd love to hear from you because this is truly an amazing way to take ordinary furniture and to make it in something uh, extraordinary before you throw away those old pieces or maybe you've you, you know you went to your aunt's house and they're giving away some old chairs or a table or you know or an end table coffee table before you do that let Amitha show you how you can breathe new life in that and make it look gorgeous. We're talking about great ways to be able to finish and fill paint, and everything is all in one step. Everything you need to transform is in one easy step. Amitha Verma, designer, a person who specializes in taking yes. things from the past <laughs> and making them look great, and whether we're antiquing them or we're bringing them into Some more fresh of a life. fresh look. Yes. I've never worked with you before. I'm yes, really excited. Yes, it's so great to meet you guys. See you. Thank you yep. so much for having me here. I'm so excited to be here, yeah. and I'm so excited to be doing a 
live furniture makeover transformation. This is going to be, be fun. so exciting. I know. Yes, 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 yes. I'm putting I, my cards away because I want to make okay, my hands free. Okay, get your hands a little bit yeah, dirty. Yeah, yeah. You won't get them too dirty. <laughs> now, I know so many of us are frustrated with out-of-date colors, mismatched sure. furniture, old kitchen cabinets from the 60s, 70s. So I'm going to show you how to use our kit and do this live makeover so you can do these amazing designer transformations all on your own. Everything you need is in the kit. It's in the kit. So Everything I don't have to need. go buy paint. I don't no. need glaze. I don't need the finishing stuff. I, everything's here. Everything's Brushes, in there. everything. Yes. Okay, so let's get started with the first step. The first step is going to be to paint your project. Now, what makes our paint so unique is you can paint with no sanding, stripping, or priming. Okay, say so, that one more time. <laughs> no sanding, stripping, or priming. Right. So we've taken six to eight weeks off of your off project. Off of the kit, okay. So right. no need to wait for hubby to help you. All right. You're going to take your paintbrush. This is included in the kit, beautiful mm -hmm. natural bristle. Dip it in. Before you get started, I want you to give your paint a good stir. Make sure and it's really, really well incorporated. Really good stir. You can see the consistency here. Yeah. It's like yogurt, and I'm going to show you what that's going to do for you. Okay. And then we're going to come over here. This is like an old dark piece of furniture. I want you to imagine that piece of yeah. furniture that you have that drives you crazy. Yeah. Yeah. And imagine this transformation. So you're going to get a coating at, on here. Look at how, how it covers. Look at how it covers. That's what that thickness does for you, as well as adheres to more than just wood. You can paint over wood, concrete, so many different surfaces. So we're just going to keep doing this. And you can see I'm hardly using any paint at all. Okay, the paint and just brush, getting it paint. all in the little cracks and yes. all the little crevices. And this is exactly what you're <clears> going to do. Okay. Now, we're going to do this all over the chair and then we're going to let it dry for 20 minutes okay i'm not going to let you wait for 20 minutes no no no. we don't have the time do you so, want to right, see well, the after yeah, let's are you ready to see the forward. after okay yeah, yeah. let's walk over here and now you're going to see the after so imagine that dark piece of furniture and now here is the after okay. it is breathtaking this mm. is what it's going to look like your project once you get home and start working on it it's going to have this gorgeous matte finish and it's going to be Stunning. Yeah. Oh, I love how it feels. Do you love yeah, how it feels? Very like beautiful. Mm -hmm. So now we're going to move on to step two, which is included in your kit. In step two, we are going to seal our newly painted finish. This is what the sealer looks like. It feels like um, shortening. Do we okay. have any Southerners yeah. watching? You know yeah. what shortening Almost is. Almost like a Vaseline type exactly. of... Exactly. Okay. Even more solid than that. All right. So we're going to use the brush that's included in the kit, dip it in, get your sealer on, and mm -hmm. then you're just going to apply a like light a shoe polish. Is exactly. Kind of, yeah. Exactly. Okay. And you're so just going to apply this on. What is this doing right now? I mean, oh, good help. question. Okay, yeah. so we want to apply the sealer to protect against soiling and staining. Okay. This is what's going to give you that long-lasting, time-lasting finish. Okay. I've got two little boys, my hubby, my pets, my kids. So we want to make sure this is going to last us a test of time. So this this size piece of furniture should take about two minutes for you to get that coverage you on you there. To cover it, okay. Super easy. All right. We're going to let that dry mm -hmm. for 20 minutes. And then we're going to move on to the third step, which is completely optional, but everybody's favorite. Yeah. Okay, let me show that to you. So we're going to walk over here. And by the way, everything that you're seeing is included in the kit that, that, that comes yes, today. Yes, so. everything mm -hmm. that you're seeing is included in the kit. Now, this is everyone's favorite part. I had to include it, but it's totally optional. If you want to take your project one step further, you can use our antiquing glaze to add this character. I've already done a little bit so you can see it. Add this mm. depth into the piece. Now, you're going to take the same brush. There's one brush for step two and step three. Okay. Dip it into your antiquing glaze. You're going to get a thin coat on, and then you're just going to use, like, a light feathering motion. Okay. I'm not... Just to kind of grab just, little highlights and yes. places. See okay. how it went on right yep. there? And you're just going to use your brush to blend. See how the brush just does mm -hmm. all of the work for you? So it does all the heavy it, lifting. It gives it so much more dimension, and it, you know what? And it gives it that antiqued look. It absolutely does. That beautiful, luxurious, yeah. high-end designer style. Look at this little medallion right here and how it just totally comes to life. Comes to life. In the before yep. chair, it looks so old-fashioned and outdated, and right. now it's the signature piece of the chair. Oh, it's gorgeous. Right, and then yes. you can decide, if, you know, if you want to uh, do the different fabric on your chair, you yes. can do that as well. You get everything. We're going to show you some really cool before and afters here that are, that are quite amazing. Why don't you take us through some of these? I mean, sure, this let is me neat. show you some of these. They're yeah. awesome. So you can see the before of this old cane back chair. A lot of us have cane pieces. It's very popular from the 50s and 60s. And look how modern and fresh and light and bright you can make it. The color you're seeing on that chair is Provence blue. What you're seeing on the little side table, the before, and then the after is in Chantilly White. Chantilly White. Let's talk about the colors a little That's, bit. I was going to say, do we, have our, do we have our little color thing we can throw out there, Erin? Let's do that because obviously you get to choose a color of you, what you want to do. We're not yes. just going to do everything in white. So right. So what are our colors? Here they are. 
This, what you're seeing on this chair right here, Chantilly White in that bottom corner, that's our number one selling color. We're probably going to sell out and we're going to have a decorating emergency. <laughs> it's everybody's favorite. Belgian blue. It's a white with a hint of blue. Very sophisticated. Mm -hmm. Latte beige, classic combination of gray and beige. So very sophisticated, both masculine, both feminine. Provence blue, that classic French countryside blue. Don't be afraid to paint a piece of furniture or your kitchen island, just like you saw that chair that mm -hmm. I did. It's a great color. And then French gray, that's our probably our number two selling color. It's that classic French gray. Is it right. blue? Yeah. Is it green? Right. Is it gray? All Kinda of the above. The I love that color. Absolutely. It's a great color. So mm -hmm. you can't go wrong with any of them. Any of them will really go beautifully with the colors in your home. Let me remind everybody, I only have 800 of these all together in all the colors. So if you're looking around your house right now and you're seeing that chair, you're seeing that little bench, you're seeing that piece of furniture and yes. you're going, I was going to throw that yes. away. Don't before, throw it away. Before you strip it, and sand it, and uh, which is, I think that's that's really 90% of the reason people don't do that's it. That's why no one does it, because it yeah. used to be so difficult, and now it's just fun. Let me show you another yeah. demo, so Let's I can show you over. how easy it is you. to use. Okay. Now think about your dining room. Now I want you to know one quarter of paint's gonna cover three, all the pieces in the kit are gonna cover three to four pieces of furniture. Okay. So think about that dark dining room set. So many of us have that dark dining room set, Imagine that as I do this transformation. I think people are also used to having to buy so much paint because it's so thin and it doesn't cover. Exactly. This is specifically made to cover on one shot. What Anitha did was she said, why do people not do this? Why do they often hire a decorative artist to do that? that because a decorative artist how doesn't... Much, how much does that cost? Hey, listen, I, I told <laughs> you I was in the business for many years of doing that and faux painting and glazing. It's expensive and it's time consuming. At least a several hundred dollars a and, piece. And a wall could take you all day. All day. This know? is going to work out to about $25 per piece yeah. to work on. And you're going to and you're going to get four. that furniture, and you could probably turn around and sell that for 10 times yeah, what you thought you were going to. Yeah, that's a different secret. <laughs> exactly. Yes. We know that. A lot of you are going right now, maybe I should start going to the flea market. Maybe we do have a <laughs> lot of people who get into the business of the finding set. old furniture. Do it. Look how quickly I have done this chair. Yeah. You could literally do this project in probably an hour. Do you know, for a while there, I, I, I started a little small thing that I used to do where I would go to, a bar, you know, old flea markets. I'd go to closeout places yes. and stuff like that. And I would buy window frames and I would turn them into mirrors. Absolutely. And I would, and I would just, uh, make I would do this. Yes. I'd make them look old, but nice. But I bet it would take forever before. It, it took, it, you know, I had to sand and do all that stuff because yes. I didn't have this. This is But you can still buy limited. something for 10 bucks and sell it for 150 oh, yeah. bucks. The value is incredible. Yeah. You can take this old set of chairs now and, and the beauty of, in them is amazing. It's going to be worth the oh, look price at, of the new Look market. at some of these pieces, how you yes, transform them. Yes, that was an old product. vintage look piece. And yeah. look at the stunning French country. That's country. Provence blue. So right? you can see how beautiful it's going to look. Now we're going to look at French gray. This is what French gray looks wow. like. It's very classic, very beautiful. And it just keeps going on and on and on. And don't yes. be afraid. I think a lot of people out there are worried that they're not going to do it right. But you include no. you include yes. a DVD, right? Yes. It can, we're doing this fast, I know. So you're going to be able to watch a DVD. I'm very verbose. I've written a little booklet for you. So mm -hmm. you can read the booklet and step-by-step step follow along. Let me show you how to do the clear sealer. And then I'm going to show you the antique okay. glaze because that's where people get really nervous. Now that you've seen the painting, you can see. Here, you want me to do Why it? So you can trying? show me. Yes. I mean, come okay, on. Okay, so dip so it in. I'm, uh, now remember, get a light you know coat. how when you do, you do, do car, uh, uh, shoe polish and you just kind of do the little tips, it's kind of the same thing. And then okay, I just kind of... light kinda... coat. You can see he's not smashing it in, or maybe you can't see, but he's not smashing it in. He's using the lightest touch, almost like a feathering motion. It goes on but really easily, too. It goes too. on so... And look at the applicator tool. It really does the work this for you. This brush is killer. It's killer. I love it. <laughs> we designed right. it to put that product on because it used to be so hard with the rag and the soft cotton cloth. What are you supposed to use? It makes this big mess, and I want it easy, well, that's effortless, and fun. Uh, when, fun, I fun, used fun. To, when I used to glaze, okay, yes. you'd, have, you'd have an old coffee can bucket. Yes. You'd have to put glaze and water in. Right. Rag. Extremely fumy yes. and toxic and yes. nasty anyway. Yes. And then you have to actually put your hand in there with gloves and then you had to try to... And how was the finish? It was uneven all the time. On, yes. Always uneven yes. and you had to work it over Absolutely. and over. And that's why there are decorative artists that do that job because right. they know that. Right. People like me, I mean, come on, we just no. want we just want to get the end look. I designed this kit for people who have not picked up a paintbrush since grade school. Mm -hmm. You cannot mess it up. 
It's foolproof. It's effortless. We'll walk you through it in the DVD. We'll walk you through it in the chest of drawers. Oh, that's what's on the DVD. As a spoiler see, alert, you know, I gave it away. <laughs> I, let me tell you something else. It's a lot of fun because you watch pieces of art come to life. Come to life. And you and yes. you did it. That's yes. the thing. So if you're looking for a project, all right, drop the crossword puzzle and come on in and try yes. to make yourself a beautiful piece of furniture. The pride that you feel, and you don't have to put a lot on. You see how I saw I had some on there? Just kind of give Very it that brush. Very little bit. Now, if you want more, you can put more. It's your home, and I want you to do what inspires you. That's the beauty of the product. If you love that heavy-handed, glazed look, go yeah. ahead and put some and more you, on. You could also get yes. a, use a little towel, and you can wipe it down a little bit if, yes. you, if you put too much on. There's no mistakes, just, right? Right. If, you, if, it, if it looks a little bit too much I, for you, just use a soft cotton Amita, cloth. And I love how it off. hits the corners and makes them look older So, oh, look at how worn. gorgeous that looks. And here you can see the contrast yeah. where it's a little bit less. Yeah, so you yeah, can do yeah. as much or as little as you like. It's very, very easy. And We're will, doing it here live. You'll learn how to use this brush too. The, using this brush is not that difficult. It's a very user-friendly brush because it has so much texture and it covers so much area and there's no angles that you have to, you just no, have to kind of. that round shape helps you get into right. all the angles. It's going to help you get into all of these grooves. So that dining room that we were talking about, imagine mm -hmm. that big, dark dining room. And now how Look you're how going to host Thanksgiving or be raising your yeah. hand. I'd love to do it this year. You know, and, and what you can do, and, and here's the real uh, the killer about this, and we'll show you some more before and afters. What I love is that you're not investing a whole day on a piece of furniture. You literally can do a piece in about an hour. In about an hour. And think of how good you feel about yourself. You created something. You're you took something so you were going to throw away no. and you made it. And you're going to give it a great. new life. You yep. can invite some of your friends over, have a paint party, mm -hmm. come over here, start with this, and then an hour later, end up with the after. And like you said, you, nobody feels good about throwing furniture away. No. You're going to feel very inspired that you've been able to reuse I, it. I love that little it. the little coffee table there on the right, the white one right there. Look at how beautiful with the little legs that things but come. I don't know what they're the called. All the details come to life. Look at how. Yeah. It, I mean, look <laughs> at how beautiful it is with the blue chair. If you've always wanted to have that you know that kind of French country look uh, and it doesn't have to be for the whole house you know there are certain parts of your house where you want to keep the wood furniture in a wood tone right we're not talking about it's good to blend every it. piece that's what makes it right. fresh and modern is when you have a little bit of the wood a little bit of the painted right. that's why people like to use our paint to transform a lot of that dark wood that they have and make it over and I don't know if you saw in the before and afters but we had a pair of lamps yeah so you can paint over metal oh yeah yeah brass chandeliers brass beds right old boxes you've got frames. metal furniture over here that you know that you've that you redid in the blue. And remember, you get enough paint to do about how many pieces? About three to four medium-sized right. pieces of furniture. So if you see more than one color that you like, you're gonna get a, a full kit of that color. This color Plus yeah. you get the DVD to go along with it. You know, if you're looking for some great uh, sort of do-it-yourself projects, these are the kind I really love. Uh, you know, it's one thing to, to plant a garden because most people's gardens are going to be gardens. But when you do something like this, when you're actually touching it with your hand, yes. it has all your personal touches. It has your story on, with it, yeah. how you found it, where yeah. you found it, that significant moment in your life, and you get to reinvent that. Mm -hmm. I'm going to remind you, I have 780 left. Uh, this, you're only here. You, you've only been here one other time, right? Was one that other it? time. All it's right. So, exciting. and and are you on again later on today? No. This so this is, our is only it. airing. All right. So if you want to grab it, it's only 99.95. But keep in mind, everything is included. You know, a lot of times you'll buy these how-to kits, and they they give you everything but the paint. But you're going to get the paint too. Erin, can we put the colors up one last time? Thank you, Andre. So we're going to put the colors up really quick. So the Belgian blue, explain the differences in the blues a little okay, bit. Okay, the could. Belgian blue is more of an off-white with a hint of blue. Provence okay. blue is that classic French country blue. It's more of a color. So if you want to get that color, go for the Provence blue. If you're looking for something that's a little bit more neutral, French gray is probably your, your best choice. Or latte beige. Chantilly white, that's what we just demoed right here. It's our most popular color. Uh, you know what? This was this is fun. I can fun. do this stuff like I, now. I'm you know my mind is like go buy old pieces of furniture and make them up and make some cash. <laughs> Maybe we can give you a few extra. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yes. <laughs> we'll make some money. It's so much fun, and and you know what? You're gonna love this. This is a great way. And you know what? Also very therapeutic. Very sort of very therapeutic. Very Put zen, your music on you. and get in the zone. You know what you're yeah, talking get about. Get started on your project. You're awesome. Thanks for Thank being here. Thank you. All right, listen everybody. Uh, we only got a handful of these remaining. I uh, a great color still available. Hey, listen. Uh, we wanted to talk about shopping our set as well, uh, which you guys can do. Uh, take a look at what we've got here. Are we talking about the pillow again or what? The bench this time. Well, we were talking about the pillow before. Now we're showing you the beautiful bench. We've got that available and we'll put some information up 
for you. Also, the rugs are available. If you want to buy any of this stuff, go to hsn.com. There's the rub, the rub, the rug. Uh, it's a six by nine patio rug. It's $149.95 uh, that you can pick up. Uh, and again, lots of great ideas to get your home the best that it can be. We are going to take a quick break. We got great stuff still coming up as we continue to shop at home. Stick around. Here at HSN, we base our retail values on nationwide information. Retail value is an indication of the price you would expect to pay for the same or similar item elsewhere, not the price at which you would be able to sell the item. Prices do vary around the country, so ours might be different from prices in your area. For more information, call one of our customer service reps at 1-800-284-3900. All right, welcome back. Look who just came back. Mr. Tim Wilkins. They let me in the house. Hi, buddy. It's good to hey. see you. Hey, uh, you know, Improvements is such a great company. And every time I open up that catalog, I look and I, I sit there and I'm like, dang, I wish I thought of that. Dang, I wish I thought of that. It, it's, it's just, it should be called dang, I wish I thought of that's, that. That's, <laughs> that's what I call it. Dang, I wish I thought of that. It's such great ideas. And this next one is, is truly one that's not just a great idea. It's, it's a real smart idea. It's called the Outdoor LED uh, Motion Sensor 3-Pack of Lights. And these are going to really help you out in a pinch when it's dark. And I don't care if it's up and down yep. stairs wherever you're going these things are going to give you the illumination that you need i only have 1500 they're a customer pick on hsn.com they're only 24.95 today discounted price these go really fast I know, they're going to sell out here's the thing about yeah. these though guy no installation no wiring nothing to deal stick with them on. you can stick them on with sticky tape or you can mount them permanently with the mounting plate that comes with them this is such a safety feature for any stairs, indoors or outdoors. A lot of the reviewers saying that it is an absolute blessing to have this at the foot of our stairs so that when I get up in the middle of the night, use the restroom, check the door to make sure it's locked, find out what that noise is, that light comes on and you feel super safe because you know where your feet are going up. We can drop the lights here. When you get within eight feet of these motion sensor lights, they automatically come on and stay on for 30 seconds to a minute. So. If you're gonna have these on, you can find your keys. You can see who's at your front yeah. door. You can see where the stairs are. And if you're gonna, here we go, going down. If we could look down here at my little steps. This, Watch. this, check this out. Now, drop them all the way, guys. Drop them all the way, and these will come right on. Now, the beauty of this by the reviewers. Now, if I'm looking here, I'm gonna walk around the corner. I go to say, hey, where's my lights? Oh, there's a light. Wow. Now, as I'm stepping up, they're look motion. at them lighting all the way up because they're motion that is sensors. Awesome. With, if you're gonna put these. Uh, in sheds, under counters, around corners, front door, back door. That's the place to have them. All right, now, camera people here, I'm gonna move left. We've got a lot of light over here on this other one, but I'm gonna show you where I've got this other one hidden. If we're, you, I'm moving left, yeah, I'm moving left. You got I've got it. one tucked in here. Oh, it came on already. Here we are, we were close enough to set this one off to the left. Imagine having this around a side where, you know, you may or may not remember to leave your front porch light on. Sure, exactly. You, maybe you don't know where your keys are gonna be, or maybe you come in through the garage and you want that light to come on for yeah. safety. Now you've got the way in your in your safest or your most dangerous of areas to have that extra light for safety with no installation, just batteries, no that's wiring. It, that's all you need, and it is so good to go. All three of these are only twenty four ninety five. So look around your house. Where would you like to have extra lighting? I know for a fact because I, you know, when my mom comes to visit, I don't have lights on the steps. I have a light above, but you can't really see. And I've tripped down those stairs before, so it really is a great measure of security to have them. You can put them anywhere. The fact that you get three, I've got people buying two, three, four sets of these right now on price break. They never seem to last. Read the reviews on hsn.com. Uh, so many five-star reviews because people are like, are you kidding me? There are places everywhere in my house I could use these things. The attic. I could use, in my closet. The closet. So I can open up and then it turns on and I can see everything in my closet. Everybody yeah. has nooks and crannies in their closets around corners yeah. that you don't have a place to put a light, no uh, outlets to put a lamp or a yeah. stand-up lamp, and let's, now you've got this to come on. Let's put some of our reviews up. We actually have some reviews we'd like to read to you because I want you to know what our friends out there are saying about this wonderful product. Here's Toir in New York. This product is a lifesaver. You can never be too careful maneuvering stairs. We've been talking about that, Tim. So lighting uh, the way is crucial as you age. Uh, that's what people, just a sample of some of the things. Check this out. Exactly, exactly. 
exactly as advertised, easy to install and works well, provides just enough light for our steps to make them safe for our visitors. And that's important. Steps, you know, people steps, People come into your house, you want to make sure it's inviting. I also love that it's security from, because if people see lights on in a house, or if lights turn on in a house when you walk by them, they're going to think somebody's there. It's, it's, it's great all the way around. It's a security feature. It's a safety feature with no, ins okay, here we go again. With no installation, no wiring, you stick it on with sticky tape or you can mount them permanently. Let's get that going here. It's not quite dark enough, but it is so easy. We're taking this one down just yeah, another touch. Yeah, we're going to drop here. them all the here way down. Here we go. Now, when we get close up, it's still... There you go. There yeah. we go. It needs to be now, very dark. <laughs> now, think, even indoors at night, if you yeah. mount this above your stairs, up or down, one at the foot, one at the top of the stairs. Yeah. So instead of turning on the bright lights, say you get up in the middle of the night, you don't want to wake up your husband or your wife. Yeah. Now you've got a way to do that. You and can put them... Kids' night lights. They're great right. night lights because they only come on when they need them. And, and you, you could put them anywhere you wanted. You could put them, I mean, you could put them here, which is a place I like to put them. I actually like to mount them right there so they show the whole stair. You could put one right there so that people, as they're walking up, uh, they can illuminate whatever they need to. But inside of a closet, in a dresser, Here's in the a beauty, pantry, right? In a pantry. Yeah. The fact that they're LEDs and the fact that they're motion sensor is two things. LEDs, you know, last a really long Forever, time. Forever, right. And the fact that it's a motion sensor that only stays on for 30 seconds to a minute mm -hmm. means you get the light you need when you need it, but then it protects the battery of the, of the life of the battery and the LED light. So you're yep. going to get extra long life out of these lights. Everything that you need to mount them is included. So, so either you do them the sticky way or you can, uh, they have a little plate that you can also mount on the back so that you can just screw them into anything. And if you're doing them in outside, you can buy little concrete screws and you can screw them in that it way. It comes with the concrete. Oh, oh no, it comes with screws. Okay. But I believe they're wood screws. Yeah, but if you needed to, like I said, it's, a, it's uh, not, you can find those anywhere. 20 cents. Yeah. But you, like I said, anywhere you want to put them, they're going to be great. I have a, uh, like I was saying to Matt earlier, I have an old shed. There's no lighting on the outside. There's no lighting inside either. So these, remember, they're not solar. You don't have to deal with that. The only thing that, the, that, that triggers them is darkness. So as soon as it gets dark, it gets dark, and they sense you moving in yes. front of them. They will trigger on how easy. That's that's just the perfect. This is absolutely perfect. And I can't stress enough, up or down the stairs, if you have a walkway out by your pool or patio, you're going to want, let's let those. And there you see go. how those just came on? Yeah, they just kicked and on. They, and you see how they're going off after about 30, 30 seconds. So they're protecting the life of the LED and the life of the batteries. But now you can safely walk. I'm with you, guy. I would mount them forward and get the full light yeah, across yeah, yeah. the That's steps. That's what I like. And yep. they look super cool. That looks super well, chic and modern. Well, a lot of modern. people, here's, here's the issue. A lot of people don't have have their stairs against the wall. They're just free stairs like right. that. So if you have that, you can stick them right to the little under part of that little stair area. I don't know what that's called. I'm sure there's a name for it. <laughs> uh, I call it the under part of the stair area. Stairia. Uh, you can put them right underneath there and you can enjoy. Listen, for this price, I mean, come on, you, you fall down the stairs one time. It's worth, these are worth their weight in gold. And especially if you've got seniors, if your parents or grandparents come to the house uh, and they leave at the end of the day and it's a little bit dark, you know, just having a light on above them, it actually sometimes lights above will actually shade the stairs a little bit oh make yeah them more dangerous and and you're getting a three pack that's a really yeah. cool thing one of, of the places we put ours is in the attic and you pull those stairs down and then you can't find the the pull for the light that's up there yeah now all i do is pull the stairs down and wave my hand on the top yes and it automatically lights up the area that's awesome it gives me enough light up top but then i can pull the string to get the whole thing lit up or find the switch if you have it safely and easily that's a really dangerous spot up there in that attic. oh my gosh it is yeah yeah and those are areas that maybe you don't want to run wiring and things like that remote areas where you don't want to have wires or cables all over the place same thing in the basement you know if you've got a wet basement you don't want wires and plugs and all that you just want to keep your stuff so you can see it i mount one of these right next to my um my fuse box yes so the power comes out and you walk into the basement and it's dark It'll light up, and now you can see what's going on. One there. of the callers we got a while back put one underneath each nightstand on either side of the bed ah. that it only comes on at night. They were able to find the remotes, but it only comes out at night as a low foot light. Right, so right. when they make that trip in the middle of the night around the house, yep. use the restroom, whatever it is, they're able to do that without turning on the main lights and disturbing their partner. I'll tell you that a lot of people are grabbing this. Again, read those reviews on hsn.com. If you want to get it, it's $24.95. It's on sale today, price break. And it's on two payments at 1248. This is one
one of those things you just you just love to have these. You just pop them in. I could find, I could get 20 of these and I'd know exactly where to put them around my house. I would never run out of spots never. to put these. We all should be illuminated. We should, I would carry one around like a little flashlight. Exactly. Just cover it up and let Anybody it go. Have seen Tim? Oh. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> nice job, my friend. Thank As you, always, sir. reminding you also, Tim brought us a Today's Special, which is crazy, crazy popular. Uh, if you want to get the house clean, you want to get the boat clean, uh, the car clean, you got an RV, you need to get those second story windows. This is 16 extra feet of reach, has a built-in soap container so you can wash and rinse. It has a little valve that'll turn the soap off, then you can rinse it, then you can turn it all off and you can squeegee it dry without ever having to get on a ladder. Uh, we also have it available in colors, um, gray, lime, blue, purple, red, fuchsia, and orange. I don't know, I think I like that lime myself. Um, anyway, also, any of the short brushes available? Aaron, do we have any? There's a compact brush that also will attach to your garden hose. So for those of you that just wanna do the quick wash of the car, you wanna wash some furniture, you know, jobs that are right in front of you, you don't need the extra 16 feet. Um, this one is a smaller one, but still does the same job. It's $14.95, and I, last I checked, we had five, 600, maybe? Maybe 600. All right, lime is gone, orange is the next to sell out in our accessory brush. All right, listen, thank you for joining me. We will be back at home on Friday, and perhaps it will be, who's going to be here? Is Brett Chuckerman? He's back? Wow, Brett will be back. We're excited about that. Anyway, I will see you guys tomorrow morning bright and early uh, on HSN Today. Get prepared because the lovely Siobhan, there she is. She's coming your way next, and she's got a great show. Hers is called Kitchen Helpers, and I think I got that same show tomorrow morning uh, at 7 o'clock in the morning. So, again, thanks for joining me. Thank you, Mr. Wilkins and all our wonderful guests and our crew. Uh, see you guys tomorrow morning. Siobhan is up next. Enjoy it in the kitchen. I'm Siobhan and we've got Kitchen Solutions. So in this hour, we are going to make you the best ribs ever with your pressure cooker, as well as beans and macaroni and cheese. But we're gonna get oh, also bun cake coming up. Your incredible collector's items are here as well as um, great giftables. But right now we're gonna be talking about the Xylus Customer Pick Easy Pull. Now this is a manual food processor. We